I am on your tutorial. Oh. Hey. My name is Michael, but you can call me Tanay. I recently participated in a character-themed photo shoot where I got to play a ton of fun characters, including the amazing Captain Jack Sparrow. I've seen other tutorials on YouTube about how to get Johnny Depp's iconic look from this movie, but most of them involved expensive products and prosthetics that I can't really afford. So I thought I'll make a tutorial for the people using products I picked up at my local Target. So let's get started. So step number one is foundation. You're gonna wanna find one that's a little bit darker than your normal skin tone. You're just gonna wanna slap that on your face and cover it with a regular powder. I just used a warm L'Oreal True Match powder. The next step is going to be bronzer. This is a highlight and contour powder palette that I picked up from Target. This step is very important because when you look at pictures of Johnny Depp, he's got those really sunken in cheekbones and the bronze pirate face. So using reference photos of Johnny Depp, try to apply the bronzer in the same areas that he has it on his face, going from the sides of the face and giving that really bronze carved in look. This can be harsh, it doesn't need to be subtle. This nothing, nothing about this is subtle. Then do the same thing with the contour area, you should get a different brush to contour than you did to bronze, but I didn't do that. <laughs> and with the contour, you're going to want to focus on where Johnny Depp's cheekbones are and how you can make that work on your own face. When you contour a man's face, the curve will go a little bit more like this. And then for the nose, take a smaller brush and the bronzer palette and just go down your nose like this and try to lengthen it. But you can see that Johnny Depp's nose, it dips in a little like this and goes out. Then start to add a highlight, particularly the cheekbone and along the bridge of the nose and on the chin. So for the eyes, what I do is I take like a regular black eyeliner pencil and just under my eyes. Over that again with a regular liquid black liner. This time I try to get over the eye as well. And this is perfect if you're not good at drawing eyeliner wings because you just smudge them because you are a man. Uh, next up is going to be the facial hair. I just took a liquid black liner again and went down my mouth and copied the shape of Johnny Depp's mustache. Curves a little bit at the bottom there, and there's a gap right there. And then to make it look more realistic, I went over it with some brown eyeshadow and a smaller brush and did little strokes so that they look like hairs, not just a big blob on your mouth. I had a little bit more highlighter. If you use your fingers, you might get your face dirty and break out, but that's life sometimes. Yeah, makeup wipes, Jack Sparrow. Oh, that would be amazing, yeah. And when you're done, because I'm new. From pirate to pirate, I <laughs> So are you a descendant? What's my name? What's my name? I haven't even watched the movie, I just know the song. It's really good. According to what, that's what people are saying. Then you gotta draw his little scar. I just used a brown pencil and a red pencil. I took a shimmery, golden, pinkish eyeshadow and just put it right on my lips to change the color a little bit. I also extended my nostrils a little bit with a black eyeliner pencil because Johnny Depp's nostrils are bigger than mine. Then after a little bit of touch-up, here's the final look without costume. So after this, I took a lunch break, put on my costume, slapped that wig on my head, and here is the finished product. You look amazing. If you liked this video, be sure to subscribe to me. I'm a very nice person with a lot to offer. Catch you later.